Good morning, Rosemary Balu here from Art BOP, and this morning we're going to have my colleague Diva Mater, who's the director and producer of the Art BOP show, tell us about the show, some of the sections that we've got, and some of the things that he's doing. So go for it, Diva. Tell us all about it. <laughs> well, it's um, it. The show basically has two components, which is video and audio. Um, and like the concept behind the show is kind of having or the like one of the main aspects of the show is having um, conversations with creatives um, across the spectrum here in the Bay of Plenty, as you, as mm -hmm. I, I think the phrase we came up with, you know, creative, creative conversa conversations, creative conversations. So, um, yeah, that's basically it. And like the videos and audio can be found on our website under the show. And you've also got under the category of show, we've been doing some other really interesting things yeah. together, like we've got pr little promotions for the content yeah. of Art BOP. Yeah. And, and highlights. Highlights. Yeah. And we've got we've had the privilege of talking to some really fabulous artists in who were coming to perform in Tauranga, people like Jacob Rajan, yeah. um, Tyro Royal. We've just done, uh, well, it hasn't gone through the show, but we've just um, spoken with Hayley Sproul of um, Live Live yeah. Cinema. Can you tell us just a little bit about how we do that? Yeah, well, <laughs> it's that's such fun. Yeah, it's, it is a lot of fun, and, you know, it's... It's kind of cool that like those kind of artists are uh, reaching out to Art BOP, um, wanting to do these kind of little promos and things like that, you know. So um, um, it's cool. It's it's again different because most of them have been on the phone, you know. Like we haven't had them in person here, um, which Does we will eventually. Does that any problems? With you and I talking to the phone, <laughs> yeah, no, I mean it, it. It looks kind of it looks kind of awkward as opposed to mm. you know face to face, but um, the main thing is the conversation or like like you know what we get out of it, and it's it's been great, you know, and they're like varied in length, like these these uh, full creative conversations are like hour, um, close to an hour, uh, sometimes more. And like, you know, these like little promos have been like 18, 20 minute little things. And and it's been great because, I mean, um, it does kind of mess with the audio a little bit when it's coming through the phone. But, um, yeah, I think the end result has been great, hasn't it? Oh, yes. It's such fun. <laughs> and we also we've we've got coming up on. Um, the Art BOP show is a major creative conversation, conversation with John Beach, and he is the director of the Tauranga Garden and Arts Festival. Yeah. And we did something for the first time with him, didn't we? Do you want yeah. to? <laughs> yeah, no, it was, it's, it's like a 30-second like spot um, promoting the Garden and Arts Festival for next year. Yeah, 2016. Yeah, so it's, it's cool with the show because, you know, it's the the – Equipment is there. The technology is available to us. So we have the liberty to do these kind of cool little 30-second spots video and also translate it to audio and, um, like, you know, inserted within the show or even separate. Um, and, yeah, like the walkthroughs have been great because... Oh, what a, to, to tell the them cameras, about our walkthroughs because we've done those with Millie Newitt at yeah. Creative Tauranga. They've been such fun. Go on. Yeah, no, yeah. it's... Um, that was cool because that was, again, like um, organised out of the blue. Like we didn't even think that was going to be another category. But... Um, yeah, so that was fun because we basically just went into Creative Taranga and you went around with Millie and just and just looked at the paintings, you know? And What's so good about that, I think, is that people will be able to use those in groups to view exhibitions they wouldn't be able to go to. 
Yeah, yeah, that's a great, it's a great tool to do that as well, you know, or it can also like, you know, be like um, a tool if the exhibition is still ongoing and they see... It's a promotional Yeah, piece. as they see the walkthrough, they can be like, oh, that looks really good. I like, you know, I want to go and have a look. Um, and so far we've just done them with Creative Taranga. The last one is, is uh, the last one that we did is the Girls College one. Um, which will be uploaded soon. And it would be cool to kind of, you know, do it with other galleries and other kind of hosts but who you, are knowledgeable. But you did one um, that was outdoors. We've recently had the official opening of the fabulous Harry McCleary bronze statues down on the waterfront. Yeah. And you went and did um, really what was a walkthrough yeah. On the family day. And you've put that up too, haven't you? Yeah, well, that's what, like, that's the section we call highlights. Right. Which is basically just footage uh, that I took, put to music, you know, kind of highlighting. Um, I what, think you did that What with the feel the, was like. The, was it the multicultural day? Yeah, did? that was the first yeah. one that I did. Good. Um, so, like, you know, because those kind of events where it's like a lot of people – and lots of things going on, you know, it's it's kind of hard to do like a one thing, like a particular um, aspect of it, you know. Um, otherwise, we'll have hours and hours of footage, you know. Um, so that was cool. So, so these are cool for those kind of events where you can just go around, have a look at the cool stuff, and, um, yeah, just like put together the best... The best things, like if you watch in the Harry McClary video, there's um they had a reading tent or a booth where like kids were sitting with dogs and things like that, and one of the kids kept on reaching over multiple times and touching the dog's nose. It was uh, like, you know, just like moments like that, which is kind of just on the spot cool. Like it kind of sums it up. Yeah, you know. So anything else you want to tell us about the show? Because we've got a big list of uh, potential guests across all the spectrum of arts and arts administration coming up. Yeah. Um, well, the show's going to keep expanding um, in terms of like, you know, this is like the studio space which we use, which is also going to be redecorated at some point. I think and that we've invited the fabulous team of architect <laughs> Phil Green and designer Diane Hume yeah. Green to give us some design pointers. Yeah, because like as you see, this is basically just a bunch of cool stuff put together, so it's not really. Um, but so, like you know, on top of that, we have had like interviews with bands, like which is like four or five people, and so we do have the potential to kind of do more segments and specials. Um, oh, the specials. Yeah. Now, they are quite lengthy conversations all there with groups of people, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. Like either with groups of people or like, you know, uh, discussing or around a certain topic. topic. Rather than just a yeah. general. Yeah, rather than just a general conversation. And I think we've had two so far. Yeah, two so far. Um, so... Like, you know, there's always like potential for that. And we keep we're going to add the category of old school. Oh, I forgot to mention as that. Well. That's so that's just uh, there are so many stories and history about particularly Tauranga and the Bay of Plenty yeah. about the development of the creative arts. Yeah. And we want to capture some of those. We're hoping to have. Uh, Beth Bowden and Shirley Sparks. Shirley developed the Tapuna Quarry. There's also um, Diane Hume Green's mother, Bev Heyman, with her long yeah. involvement in the development of the jazz festival here. Yeah, Things see, like, like th yeah, it would be, and it would be very cool because, you know, it would be a way to have a conversation about that history um, and and kind of capture it forever on yes. the internet you know um where like you know otherwise like these uh forms like books or even like you know it's not it's a very it's not lively yeah no, it's a different um perspective 
recording someone, isn't it? Yeah. And just ha- being able to um, write, write it yeah. down. Yeah, because you have look. the person right there. Yeah. And they are the history. Yes, you know? yes. So, they, oh, that's yeah, going so to be, be cool. amazing. And, um, yeah, so the the audio podcasts are available for download through SoundCloud. Um we are working on getting a RSS feed going so people can subscribe to it on iTunes and other podcast directories and basically listen to the audio whenever, wherever. Right. You know, uh, at their own convenience. And, um, and that's, that's great because with mo- mobile devices and things like that nowadays, you know, that's preferable. Um, well, we, we call ourselves, don't we? Art BOP that we're a multimedia, yeah, it is. Now it is basically because um, yeah. So you have that, and the videos are on YouTube, uh, like you know to check. But we've got we've got it well. all, haven't we? Because we've and still got our website. little bits of paper, yeah, that we put through the cafes and things. Yeah. But we've got all of these other aspects too. Yeah, yeah, that and publication, t- and it's cool because like you know. Um, it's it's a great opportunity as well because, like, you know, we can do things like 30-second spots for upcoming events or uh, walkthrough for galleries or even, like, specialized promos like we did with the Modern Māori Quartet or um, the um, Okareka Dance Company, you know? Um, so, yeah, it's, 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 it's good because... Like you know, we're fine. Like we're just like building momentum towards having more like variety of people and a variety of hosts. Oh, I, I, as yes, well. it's not just you and I, is it? No, we've, no, we've cause... had a fabulous team of people. <laughs> yeah, because it's it's like it, 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 that's one of the cool things as well. Because uh, like you know, because the spectrum of artists and creativity is so varied. Um, like you know we may not be the best people to talk to them on that level like you know especially with like uh, I, I guess the Linda Ingalls interview which Beth did uh, I don't know anything about fabric or embroidery or anything that's a fabulous you know? <laughs> um, example of the special topics yeah the other one that Beth um, Bowden did for our BOP show was the interview with the young cellist Dominic Lee. Yeah. And I think we have coming up, don't we? We have local writer Jenny Argonte is going to be interviewing another writer. And then yeah. Diane Hume Green, one of our regular contributors, is going to be interviewing Jenny Argonte. Yeah. Yeah. So, and and, and that's cool because, you know, it, it, it could be a conversation at that level of art, of their artistry. Yes. Which, um, yeah, I like you know I don't know much about, it, or I wouldn't have as much not expertise. What we're doing, aren't <laughs> we? Because I actually I'm like the little swan underneath, peddling frantically, getting all of these little people organised. Yeah. What we're doing, you and I, in our combined effort, is facilitating again the promotion of arts and creativity around the Bay of Plenty. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And and you know, I was um I was talking about this when we had Linda Ingalls on actually that, you know, it's interesting how we've had so such a variety of conversations with a variety of artists, but there are always consistent themes in terms of creativity and uh what it means to be creative and the environment our our bay of plenty region like what's that been like and that's and that's great because it's it's like you know it's just strengthening the 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 creative community that much more you know anything else you think you want to tell people about what we're doing with the art bop show no i think i think we've covered it good um yeah well, Anything thank else? you for the explanation, my colleague Divart. Do you think now we'd better me. get on and do the promo for the yeah. monthly content yes. for Art BOP? Yes, cool. for September. Thank you, Divart. All right.